how to show you how to install the clockwork mode custom recovery on your HTC Chacha. So first of all, you need to do two things. Connect your phone with the USB cable to the computer. And the next thing you need to do is you need to download this file, file and you can find it in my video description. So, um, now, the, what we need to do is this. Go to settings. like this you go to power you go down and you need to turn off the power the fast boot option turn it off now go back go to applications go to development and turn on the USB debugging just like this now you can go back to the home screen and what we need to do now is after you have downloaded this file you need to extract it just like this so you should have this file so after you have extracted the file go to computer just like this Go to the local drive and just move this file that you have uh, just extracted. Move this Android file here. So you must have this file here. Now exit. And what we need to do now is this. Go to the start and type this C M T and here you have this application. Click on it and you should have something like this. Now if you are using Windows XP, just go to start all programs. Go to Accessories, and here is the same application. It's called Command Prompt. So, now what we need to do is this. I will show you better now. So, what we need to do now is this. Type C, D, double dot, and press Enter. So you should go back in the option. So type again CD, go back and press enter. So now make sure you're, you are in your local drive. Uh, once, you are, once you are in your local drive, press, uh, type this, CD, press on the space bar and write Android and press enter uh, so here we are in our Android file so what we need to do nextly is type adb uh, space reboot press on the space bar again and write boot looter so once you're ready, we will do this. Once you have um, write the command, we need to press enter. Just like this, go here and make sure you click on enter. So how you see, now uh, we have give the command to the computer to restart our phone. Oh, you see it's flashing and here it is so now we are in the bootloader so how, how you can see 
uh, my bootloader is unlocked so if your bootloader is not unlocked make sure you go on HTC um, dev.com and you unlock your bootloader and you should have something like this unlocked so um, now that we are here uh, we need to type our next command uh, in the command prompt I will show you how so now we need to type our next command so write um, fast boot and then press enter so if uh, everything goes okay you should have uh, something like this so now we need to type the next command so write this fast boot space flash space recovery space again recovery dot emg img so that is our last command and uh, sorry there is another command after uh, now you need to press enter how you see is sending our custom recovery to the to the to our HTC cha cha so here it's um, here we finish so if uh, everything goes okay you should have something like this so next uh, what we need to do now is type this command now fast boot reboot and that's the command to reboot our our HTC cha cha okay now we just need to press enter here is the phone you can see we need to press enter and we need to root our phone how you see it's rebooting you see so now the custom recovery it should be ready after we reboot our phone we need to turn it back off and to check if our custom recovery is uh, is okay need to reboot it so now to reboot uh, reboot we press the power button we power it off phone <coughs> ah, so now just we wait it's not still off we can unplug our USB cable we don't need it anymore okay now we need to enter our custom recovery so to do this you need to press the volume button down like this and then the power button and how you see we are in our bootloader so now you need to select uh, sorry you need to select the recovery option with the volume button just like this press one time just like this and then you push the power button to select it just like this just we need to wait a little and we'll have our custom recovery and here it is our custom recovery so now how you see it's, we check if everything is okay just okay I want just to tell you I want to advise you to make uh, to make now the uh, to bake up your files to make uh, make an Android backup so if you want to like to install custom ROM something like this you will need you will be more secure so if something goes wrong you will have your um, stock ROM ready to reflash.
So now, um, ah, here is a little change that uh, just in the menu that um, you scroll in the volume button, but to enter a menu, uh, you need to press the enter button like this. You go here, just let me focus on it. You need to press enter. So shall I show it to you like this? And then, sorry, and then you press the back button. Okay, and here we are done. So save the backup on your computer. You will find it in the SD card. So save the backup on your computer in a save folder and you'll be uh, more secure when you need to install custom ROMs and something like this. Suppose something goes wrong, you will have always your stock ROM ready to refresh and that will save you. So thanks for watching and if you want to learn how to flash ROMs, custom ROMs, so just search among my videos and I'll be happy to show it to you. So thanks for watching.